Good morning, everybody. Murph here playing Medieval Dynasty. What are we here? Episode 11, right? Holy mackerel. Uh, I gotta start being careful because I think I have... Uh, like three or four to upload. <laughs> so, if you happen to see me, like, F up somewhere and you make a comment, I may have fixed it in the next couple of episodes. It's not that I ignored you, it's that um, I just haven't posted what I've recorded so far. Anyway, I'm pretty damn excited here. Um, but I got some thinking to do. I think... Yeah, I can see this. I'm seeing it in my head. Alright, first things first to separate this off. Let's... I don't know why this didn't have roads between it anyway. Oh. Actually, let me just take it. Take it. I was just thinking. Okay. This out here is gonna be designated for once I start building animals. You know what I mean building structures for animals um, and we do have our first that's what I'm excited about now what is this this is the barn yeah this is actually a good I don't know how big this thing is let's check it out I haven't even looked at it yet I just saw I unlocked it and I said okay time for an episode there it is I got a lot of log zombies you can see uh, the hen house oh it is kind of big Bigger than I thought. Okay. Um, right. Let's do this. Okay, so how far out are we gonna do this thing? This is our main road into, all right. So we can at least go like, I guess we could connect them, right? The other one was connected somewhere. I don't remember where, but... Oh, right there. <laughs> okay, that, that's actually not bad. And maybe I'll just put the hen house right behind the excavation hut, whatever that's called. We've got a new resident. I'll, I'll, I'll fill you in on all the details in a minute. All right, let me put this right here. Or do I want to give it a little space? I'll give it a little space. Bang. Ah, I could have centered that better. You know what? I got enough logs on me. First thing, let's see what we need to do here. Log. Oh, it's gonna put the sticks first, okay. Okay, so this should finish it up. Got the straw. Got a couple more logs for the other side. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot. Damn it. I just looked. I need some planks. I don't think I have uh, any on uh, me. This is the first building I've needed anything other than... Oh, I wonder... I didn't even check. No, okay. Good thing I can't upgrade that. How many planks did that say? 5 or 15? I hope it said 5. But anyway, I think we have a lot of planks. Uh-oh, I hope it said 5. Look at our cool plum trees. Still can't harvest anything off them, but... Man, they take a long time. I got a bunch of stuff to show you. Where am I going? Okay, uh, let's finish this up. Now, I'm sure we're gonna have to buy a bunch of chickens or hens. Alright, we got a hen house. And I think they're expensive, but... That's so cool! See, could I have made that stone? I'm gonna kill myself. I hope this just breaks one wall. Okay. Um, no. Okay. That's fine. Speaking of upgrading. So as I told you, we, we took on a new tenant. Her name is Jeremira. And by the way, all these guys are doing what's best for their skills now. For instance, she's a cook, so her cooking skill is high, and so on and so forth. He's a hunter, she's a hunter, her hunting skill is high. You know what I mean? So everyone's in the best spot for their jobs. Now, here's my newest house. One thing I didn't do when I upgraded all these to stone is upgrade the roofs. And I haven't even checked recently. Right, nothing's getting red yet, thank God. Okay. But. I'm figuring that'll help their happiness more. Now, another thing, when I was building this, I noticed this piece, and I remembered. I didn't do that piece on all these. I totally forgot about it. I had done it on this one. The original stone one I built. So now for a little while I'm going to keep them in here and compare the happiness to a full upgraded house with the roofs. Um, full stone without the little jimmy jams up there. Um, and no roof. And then, you know what I mean. So I wonder if it took any kind of effect yet. So we notice... Zygmunda's 21. I'll bet you Zygmunda lives here. No, that was Jaromika. Jaromika. Oh, but she's still going up. She was the newest one I put in here. And when I asked her to move in, I didn't have a house for her. So she sat outside for a while. Her thing was like minus four. So that's still going up. So who is in there? Oh, she's in there. So I'll bet you this one should be in here. And who did I just say? This one. Zygmunta. Ziggy. Yep. Okay. So that makes a big difference. That makes a difference of about two to three because these are all the same and they have all the same kind of house. I just forgot the, the two pieces on each of their house. This one I think, so I'm expecting her to get above 21. I'm still gonna wait before I start fixing all that stuff. But I'm pretty sure eventually having it fully upgraded like that is gonna be my best bet. Now here's what I'm thinking with the houses. I'm gonna keep them going this way. And then in the middle here, I'm gonna put like some campfires and some benches. Uh, and things of that sort that I don't have unlocked yet, but because I don't want to spend the money on most of them, I'm, a, I, I'm assuming eventually I'll unlock most of that stuff. Alright, what's next? Oh, this whole field is 
plowed and planted. So we've got onions over here, and we've got cabbages over here. I'm still waiting on these carrots that I planted a while ago. Uh, and then we'll start working from there. The fact is, seeds cost money, and, and so does fertilizer. So eventually, once we start getting a bunch of animals made, we will take their poop, make our own fertilizer. There's probably a way to extract seeds from the crops. I haven't looked into that yet, but obviously we want to become self-sufficient. Another thing, as I'm walking around here and looking, this well is fantastic. So I ran out of water, and look, I'm fine now. So I went and grabbed all the buckets, and I brought them to the well, and all you have to do is go like this, go like this, choose how many you want. You just do choose all like I always do and bang, it fills them all up uh, and you go put them back in your food storage and you're golden. So speaking of that, I'll let you see. Uh, our demand for wood is 130 a day. We've got 960 stored. Water, 180 a day. We've got 1675 stored. Uh, and food, 180 with 288 stored. As soon as these onions come up, we'll start doing like meat with gravy and things like that and have her cook that. But for now, she's still just roasting meat at a steady 21 per day, which is not bad. Um, and you come over here. I gotta start remembering what all these things are called, man. So she's very busy too in the smithy. What she's doing is making wood hammers, stone axes, stone knives. Now what that does, the axes get supplied to the, uh, the lumberjack, and the knives get supplied to the hunter's lodge, and she needs hammers, I believe, right? Yeah, she needs hammers. So... This is like our core work area to keep us going. And we're gonna have to make sure she's productive enough. Right now, I've got her doing mostly hammers again because that's what she's using uh, to make the axes and the knives. And in order to make the axes and the knives, you need stones, which of course, this one, Zygmuta. Oh, she's got no tools. Oh, I haven't even gotten to her yet, to be honest with you. So I'm going to go make a pickaxe and a shovel. But eventually, I think... Is it this one? Is she going to have to do this too? Pickaxes and shovels? We should probably do that, right? Let's do that. And then we won't supply her with one. But we'll see if she she does it on her own. So I'm going to have to take some production off somewhere else. Um, maybe off the hammers. If worse comes to worse, I could go make like 10 hammers and drop them to her. So I'm going to take 25% off that. Uh, and then, no, you know what? We're going to go 20 on everything. And then we'll go to the pickaxe. We'll throw 20 on that. We're going to have to see why we have no logs. Um, and what was the other one? The shovel, right? Shovel. Same deal. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I can't... Locked! Oh, wooden shovel. No, where's the stone shovel? can't even do a stone shovel. Should we open up the wooden shovel? I mean the stone shovel. Where the hell is it? Why is there no stone shovel? Wait a minute. Yeah, why is there no stone shovel? 
All right, I'll have to figure that out another time. But as long as she's doing the other stuff, we're okay. Uh, no resources. Oh, for the other things, that's right. So what does she need? She needs logs. All right. So this one down here has got to make some more logs. Oh, that could be why, too, because I don't have anybody here. Which brings me to my next thought. Is it time to go get married? dried meat. And I found out to make dried meat, we're gonna have to make kitchen two. Which I didn't check if it's unlocked or not. I want this house for me, but for some reason I moved someone else into it. But there's gotta be a way to, to change that. I'm booting her. No, that didn't work. I wanna rem oh, remove her. There she goes. Why can't I put me here? Where am I? It doesn't... I can't see me here. So I don't know how to see... I could check each house on the management screen, but I don't know which house represents which one. We lost count of the numbers. So I could just check each nameplate here. That's Zygmuda. I'm saying these names so... Oh, that's me right there, Rasenka, right? So I want to remove this. I can't remove myself. Are you kidding me? Oh, wait. Yeah. It won't let me remove myself. I'm going to try some quick save. Can I move her... I bet you if I knock this building down, it would let me. But you know what? Whatever. I guess I live in the little house. The reason I'm saying that is because if I put a wife in this house, actually, I don't want a bunch of kids. Maybe I'll just make sure the that this girl. This girl stays, uh... I'll bet you she's gonna be real happy now. Oh, I should have checked that before. I wasn't taking that into consideration. Holy moly. Okay, let's do something. I've been yapping it up uh, today. So let's see that. Oh, the dried meat I can't do unless we can make kitchen two. Yep, that poem just came out of nowhere. Um, hunting, right? No. Production. Here's kitchen one, here's kitchen two. We're not even close. There's gotta be somewhere we can buy dried meat. We're not even close to that. Um. Yeah, I guess I go find a wife, right? That would be kind of cool. Where should I go? I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter. Closest town. Let's go. Wait. I mean, I don't really need one, but... <laughs> we may as well spruce ourselves up. How's my weight? Eh, I got some stuff on me I probably don't need. I should show you all the skills I've been upgrading while I'm working offline as well. Um, I 
That's true. Especially these, like... I don't really feel like going off from this. It'll take a, a year. But the, the most important thing is I've upped my stamina consumption to the max level. <clears throat> and I've also upped my um, weight capacity up to the max level. Now it's at 60. So that's real good when I'm building. I can carry a lot more logs now. I almost miss the winter when it's so easy to see the animals and the rocks. I know, I was, I was watching through one of my old episodes right in the beginning. I'm like, oh, it sucks in the winter. You can't see the rocks. It's the total opposite. The total opposite. It was just that first rock I saw. What's that, Mr. Fox? It was just in a weird angle. All right. Little do you know it, my lucky Freylein, but your Prince Charming's about to walk through these gates. Where are you? Are you? No, you're a shop. Do I need a shop right now? I do need seeds. Hold on. For this thing. Um, okay, I have the onion seeds. I need two beetroot seed? Wait, I have it. Or do I need eight? Do I have eight onion seeds or do I have two? I have eight. Okay, we have enough, so we can actually do that. Where is that? Before I forget. Alright, we'll do that next. I don't know what's gonna happen after we ask for a wife. Maybe we should go do that now. Okay. You know, now with that good stamina consumption, going 500 meters is not as daunting as it once was. Maybe we can find a wife here anyway. I got your seeds, bud. The reason that's so important to me, if you look at our journal and our completed quests. I don't know why that opens all the time like that. I just like this one. No. This one. No. None of them. Um, I have no failed quests anywhere. I don't know if there's any kind of achievement for that or anything, but what the heck. Uh, the one thing there probably is an achievement for is doing all the quests, which I don't think I've done because a couple times people asked me for something that I didn't have. And I turned it down, and I probably never went back when I did have that thing. Alright, you're a shop owner, so what do I need? Is anybody... Hmm. So it's not gonna be... I don't think it's gonna be that easy. This one's already got a kid. So no, we don't wanna talk to her. She's kinda cute, I guess. But my point is, it might not be that easy where I might have to keep coming back and forth. So maybe it's better to go back here uh, and look for somebody. There's no more missions here, are there? No. Go back. I just thought that was a cool view. I can't wait till I'm able to put fences up. There, I could put like a little stupid fence up right now. This thing. No, I can't even do that. I'd have to buy that one for 150 coins. Do that for 250. And they start getting real expensive. Ah, uh, everything's expensive, expensive, expensive. So, on that note, we're gonna have to start really thinking about producing something we can sell. And then kind of. Especially for the taxes. I paid the taxes, it was like. 500 something coins for the first year. Oh, I wonder if there's any chickens around here. Do you sell chickens or just these little goats? I want a goat too, man. I want everything. I haven't seen, yeah, I have seen a chicken hut. I don't remember where. Okay, what are we doing here? We're looking for a lady. Hello, lady. 
cute too. All right. How is life treating you? So I guess we're gonna start. We have to get our affection level. I don't know. I guess to a hundred. So where do we start? Romance. did that, tried to give her a gift thing. But, um, it didn't work too well, so I kind of stay away from that now. Oh, so we gotta go back and forth. See, that's what I thought. So we got Temp Alruna. We're gonna have to remember that. Can I small talk her? Oh, you can ask them about their skills. See you soon. We gotta come back and talk to Aluna. I don't like her though. See you soon. Some of them say goodbye nicely. She's mad. How can I help you? Yeah, I thought so. Oh no. Goodbye. Either way, you have to meet him over here. So I guess you're it. Okay, so on that note. Um what shall I do? Oh yeah. Oh, we can't get... Oh, anybody sell dried meat? Hello? Hello? We don't sell dried meat, but it's good to know there's a How is life here. treating you? Whatever you need, I've got it. Except food, right? See you soon. Alright, where's the other one over here? Oh, that's the... We got her. Hey, what's this one? How can I help you? I don't think he's gonna. My have any wares meat. never disappoint. He does. Well, he's got stuff, but not really. Have Damn. a good day. Have a good day. Have a good day. All right, next town. I gotta find some dried meat. I don't want to do the dried meat thing now. I have to wait for next season. I mean, there's really nothing else to do. Unless I look for, like... There's not even a side quest. Not one. You know what? Let's go... I'm gonna head up here. Because then these are all easy to hit. But, it's getting late. What's she doing? All right, I'll bring you back when I figure out what the hell we're doing. So I've been rolling on this one and she didn't stop me. Look, I'm up to 25 already. Oh, now I could ask her this. Oh! Wasn't the thing to do. But I got her up to 25. See you soon. And I like the way she says goodbye. Alright, we're sticking with you. Her name is Bolamira. Bolamira. Okay, so we gotta remember she's here. That's cool. That's still right next to us. Um, I think that's the last one I'm gonna be able to check before the shops close. So I'm gonna head here. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that now. We're gonna have to find dried meat somewhere. I'm gonna just have to try, you know, this town, this town, this town, tomorrow. I could just sleep at a campfire. Just get it over with right now, right? 
course I have no sticks on me. Um, that's what I'm gonna do. Alright, next day. Let's move on and find some damn... Wait, that's not gonna be easy. I don't wanna cross twice, so... All right, meet you in the next town. But um, I knew I'd find one eventually. All right, I need twenty, right? It was in the hunting, dude. No, I don't want that much. No. Look, he's got salted meat. He's got dried meat. He's got regular meat. Farewell. Farewell, dude. Thanks for your help. All right. So now... Uh, we got this. We got this. One water skin with water. Should be easy enough, right? Oh, no. I don't know if I could craft a water Greetings. skin. Greetings. Only goods of the skins? highest quality. <gasps> you sell water skins. That's amazing. 255 Damn. Damn, 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 damn. You buy arrows for two? There's a good money maker right there. You know what? a good money maker. I'm gonna go home and make a ton of arrows. Two a pop? I can make like 200 arrows in no time. That's four, 400 coins. Now of course I have no ammo, but that's fine. I'm just going home. It was nice seeing you. Um, actually, let's see if I could go fill up this water skin at a regular water source, or if I have to go home and use my well. I should be able to do it right here. And then that's it. Oh no, now I don't have enough coins, right? Of course I don't. Oh my god. Uh, water skin, where is it? says I have four water skins with water. Huh. All right, so now we need 500 coins. That's a son of a bitch. What's gonna be our easiest way to do that? First of all, let's go home. bunch of stones. I had plenty of sticks, which I put in here. Feathers here. And let's hope I can make like 250. 17. That's gonna be 170, isn't it? Damn! Alright. So can we get 80 this time? No. 70. That's gonna have to do. Uh, I think it was two point something we were getting anyway, and I've got a couple coins. I'm sure I could sell some. You know what? I'll grab a bunch of meat. Meat sells for like a buck a pop. I can grab a hundred. Alright, that's what we're gonna do. Oh, I don't have as much meat as I thought. I guess we're eating more now. All right, weight is good, health is good, all that stuff is good. I so let's see where we gotta go. 
we have that, we have that, so we just need the coins, and then we have to deliver it. I guess it's not gonna show me till I have the coins, are you kidding me? It's probably over here. So I'm gonna go here real quick and sell these arrows. Wow, I'm actually getting 3.5. So I'm gonna sell like 200 keep some for myself. Actually, maybe 150. Um, yeah, that's like 500 bucks right there. I'll take that. Okay, that was worth it. Goodbye. So now I have everything for that dude, right? Delivered to Kestrel. Where was Kestrel? Oh, I remember. Oh, I know where she is. She's far, isn't she? Yep, she's right there. Is that her? Yeah, that's her. Oh my goodness. All right, well, we gotta finish this up. Oh, no shovel next to it, which makes me think I probably saw it already. No, we got some kerns. Look at that, now I really didn't have to sell all my arrows. I still have 82, so. That's pretty cool, that was a win-win. I needed to craft arrows, I needed coins, so I just crafted some extra arrows, and I got arrows and coins. I mean, that sounds like a plan in action. Look at all these rabbits. Y'all lucky I'm not into, oh my gosh, look at them all. And, and when you need a rabbit, you see none. Okay. Can you guys see that last save, save last zero minutes, 30 seconds? Anyway, that's when I hit my shadow play. When something happens in the game that I want recorded, I have it set to record the last 30 seconds. Anyway, just a little, little Murph recording trivia there for you. Should I be showing you guys this long run? We haven't done it for a while. We are at 37 minutes. And I'm uh, somebody left those logs there. I'll take that axe though, thank you very much. But you know what? You can keep the logs. You can just keep them. What, what made the developer think that would be a fun thing to find? Like, who wants to just carry an extra three logs when they're roaming around? Literally one tree if you have a shovel. Not even. If you have one of them trees, one. You get four, plus you get the stump if you have the shovel. But we did want to see this view in the daytime, right? Last time we got up here, it was nighttime. <laughs> Look at that. Coming next. Hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah. Good job, devs. Right after I blasted you. Oh, it's even higher over here. Let's see what it looks like over here. You know what? The lake made it look so much better, but that's not bad. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that double one. Okay, um, yeah, I guess I'll just continue on. No, don't hurt me. Okay, good. We're good. As soon as I paused, I ran down the hill when I just said we're good. And look at this, we got a little campsite with the bronze axe. You could sell that bitch. Firewood you could keep. Is there something down there? Um, oh, can I use this? No. I thought maybe it would glow if there was some, like, wine. That sells awesome. Now I have to look around better, because there's never just one wine bottle. Actually, if that was an empty wine bottle, that doesn't sell for as good as if it was a full one, and I think it was an empty one. Okay, fair enough. The axe was cool. What's the value on that thing? $350. $350. Oh, 
Well, that's the value, and I think it'll be a little... Oh, I'm heavy now. Um... Oops. I hate to drop all these stones, but... like we're gonna have to. I still got another 500 meters to go. What? Alright. This will be the last thing we complete for the episode. We'll start going home and working on our, our little flings. Maybe make one of them in the near future. Alright, dude. This is an expensive thing you just sent me on. I hope you make it worth it. Kestrel. Wow, I don't think I got anything. I got a lot of reputation. I don't know what good that's doing me. Talk to someone else? Are they close? They're right here. Oh, that's that dude at the campsite, right? But this time I don't see the yellow circle around there. Let's go see what's up with this. Alright, I already see the smoke. Ooh, I killed one of you guys. What's up, my dude? You're living around all these animals, ain't you? This might be a great story, but... I'll catch the cliff notes online. Oh man, he's just sending me somewhere else. All the way up there, huh? If you don't mind out, you don't mind, dude. I'm gonna camp out here. So I'm telling my friends here that I thank them for watching, and that we'll see them next episode. Moving right along. Moving right along. <laughs>